It's easy to conquer when it's good weather. You got good sleep, work's going good, the family's good, you feel great, your body's not injured. Those are the easy days to conquer. But who are you on those fucking days when all hell's broke loose? Your body's fucked up, you're sore, you're depressed, you're miserable. Who are you on those days when it's all fucked up? Of course, you don't feel like doing it. It's hard, whatever it is and you rationalize and you justify and you make excuses like a high-priced defense attorney trying to win the case for weakness. And boy, I'll tell you what, that lawyer in your head is good. That lawyer knows just what to say. That lawyer knows all the legal loopholes and definitely knows how to sway the jury. So how do you compete with that? Don't play the game. Don't argue, don't discuss, don't negotiate. You tell that snake of a lawyer that's in your head to shut up. Tell me you don't want to hear it. Tell me you don't need to hear it because you are not the guilty party. You are in the right. You are on the side of strength and stability and you don't need approval from this lazy lawyer to go and do what you're supposed to do. That's the great divide. Those people who get up on those days when everything's f***ed up and still crying, that's the separate right there. You don't negotiate with the weakness in your head. You get your ass up, you get moving, and you get the fuck after it, no matter how you feel. What if for 10 years, you didn't avoid doing what you knew you needed to do? What would your life be like? What would happen if you just stopped wasting the opportunities that are in front of you? 